Okay. Uh, so I want you to um, uh, practice with your right hand. You're going to be tapping, right? And this is going to keep your left hand in line. It's really important. This music is a physical music. You have to feel it in your body. And if you do this, you should have bruised thighs. <laughs> get bruised thighs, you know you've been practicing enough. So being able to do this, to keep this going while you're playing the bass line is really important. So do it without the metronome first, but then do it with the metronome. So we'll do it with the metronome. And just being able to do this with either hand, really, but really locking in with your right hand. This is going to give you the, um, what do you call it, the scaffolding. <laughs> So, that's it. And do that over and over again until you feel relaxed and like you can breathe when you're doing it. sound like a lot of notes but this is this has to just be you're walking in the park strolling around okay uh, and that's the only way it's gonna feel right at first you're gonna be stiff because you're thinking a lot it's a lot of things to think about uh, but again this this music is about uh, parts in reference to one another okay and if you want it to feel good, which we want it to feel good, that's why we play music. It has to adhere to that, um, what do you call it? Yeah, like, I don't know. It's not a template. Template, Sca I like to think about it as scaffolding because it holds everything in place while you build how the feel is gonna go and then you take the scaffolding away and everything's still strong, it's still there. So, you know. <laughs> 